What's up guys, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to add anchors to your Wix website. This could be useful because it could direct people to important information on certain pages, um, or it's useful because you could add like a scroll down button or a back to top button, all very useful. Before we hop into that guys, wixmywebsite.com. If you have not yet signed up for my, uh, get on my email list for this course, go ahead and do so. Uh, it's making me so happy seeing some of you guys take the next step and in taking that initiative to gain more knowledge on Wix and learn how to build your own website from scratch to finish. Um, once again, guys, if you have not yet signed up on the email list to get notified when the course goes live, the email list will be the first to know and the first 10 people to enroll will get a very valuable gift. So go ahead and do that if you have not done that yet. Now, how to add a anchor to your Wix website. You're simply going to go up here to add, and then traditionally it will open automatically in text. And then we're going to scroll down to more. And then you'll see anchor menus and anchors. I'll get into anchor menus at a different time, but for today, how to add an anchor. You'll simply click anchor. Once you do that, you will see right here your anchor has been placed. Now the anchor isn't actually visible to anybody. This is just like an imaginary line on your page that you could link. So let's say you have information at the bottom of your home page, but it's not visible like when you first log on to the home page. You could add a button that allows you to click the button and it'll dra bring you dra drag you down to the anchor spot and that will display the information. So to actually link an anchor to a button, you would click add, button, go to button, and then once you're in button, you'll click on the link. Now you'll see right here, it says page slash anchor, and then you choose what page. We're on new page, this is just a one that I created for this. And then you'll see right here, what the anchor you would choose. So this is anchor one, so you would click anchor one, bam, just like that. Now if we wanna move the anchor down just for sake of this video to give you kind of a description and our, uh, an example, we'll click preview, click the button, and there you go, it drops, brings us down to uh, anchor one. Now this is obviously a lot better looking, especially when there's more content on the page, but you can see the anchor's invisible. Um, but yeah, it's simply that easy to add an anchor here on Wix. Uh, if you have not done this or utilized this yet on your website, I recommend giving it a shot. It is very useful and helps gather people to certain information. Once again, guys, if this video helped you out, please drop a like down below. Comment if you have any questions at all. And don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD of Gilbert as I'm looking forward to growing with you guys and part of that growth is like I've mentioned wixmywebsite.com if you have not yet signed up on the email list to get notified when this course goes live go ahead and do that because I'm here to help you grow on Wix and show you about it and help you grow your knowledge and show you how to build a web Wix website from scratch to finish so if that's something that interests you guys go ahead and get onto this web page click that button down below and I look forward to seeing you on there thank you guys for spending a couple minutes with me and I'll catch you on the next one